All right, guys, welcome back. We're here with another episode of Dyson Sphere Program Let's Play. And in the last episode, I made a slight adjustment here to feed these uh, CPU parts into both of these so that uh, I don't have to put them in manually. But the production is quite slow. What does it take? That and that. I can probably add another one. All I really have to do is do something. Change this up a little bit. And then... So, and we will use a sorter to just pop that over, and oh, what am I doing? I don't need that. I don't need the silicone parts. What am I doing? Ah, oh, I'm, I'm so dumb. I already have everything I need right here. Completely oblivious. Okay. And I'll hook this up with some sorters. I guess I need to make more of these guys. Because this one isn't getting any. Okay. I'm not going to worry about it too much, actually. What I'll do is I'll limit how many... I see, like, two stacks. This doesn't matter. This is out of engines. We need some engine production, so for that I need those green magnetic rings. So we did not fly the right way. I need to go to my motors, which are
over here. Okay, good. I got a good amount of motors. Let's go back. Uh, where was I going? This way. So what I need to do now is ramp up my power production and start using a lot more of these planetary logistics. Screw a main bus. Ah, uh, it's weird. There we go. Uh, I needed a drink of water. All right. It's not able to get any CPUs. Let's expand this. I need to crank out some uh, interplanetary logistics, interstellar. There we go. Coppers. Bring this copper down over here, like so. And with this, I will bring it up. And then down. Oh, you son of a bitch. Oh man, I need some power. I wonder what I need for those, um, solar collectors. Gas Giant Exploitation. Orbit Collector. There it is! Then I can start getting fire ice. I need to place a... Power Tower. Say right here. What kind of... Uh... Green, green. Yellow, yellow. Uh, I need sorters. That's what I want. Okay. Okay. 
lack of item. Let's go get some. There it is. Ah, the juice again. Hey, relax. Come here. Come here. Sit down. Relax. Relax. Okay. I want to head back to here. Okay. And do a similar thing here. There we go. Oh, what am I doing? Go. Let's get some power. Output these. Connect these up. There we go. Throw a sorter onto that box. And there we go. Like we're going at a good rate. I'm starting to fill up now. Yep. Yep, yep, yep. Good. And we got a bunch more of these now. There we go. more vessels. How many do we have of these in total now? 14. Mm. 
Uh, we're going to end up using a lot of these, I feel, so... Now that we got a bit more of these chips going, we're good. Research speed slow. Uh, let me go look at what's going on. Can we expand our yellow? Do we have a... Looks like we can probably expand our yellow. What do I need for a lab? A bunch of stuff I don't have. I should start producing these over at my other's place. At my little shitty main bus area. First, I need some some juice. Oh, there's a oh, no, that's water. I thought that was hydrogen. Why am I dumb? There's the hydrogen. Fuck. Stupid. Give me some of that good, good fuel. There we go. Grab a few more. All right. Uh, I want to build some science labs over here. Do I have glass available anywhere? This is a glass. No, this is silicone. No, this is glass. Okay, good. Silicone and glass look very similar. Okay, so what do I need for... Okay. Chips, iron. Okay, so there's some iron here. I got chips out over there. I got glass here. And then I need those magnetic... Magnetic rings, which I have coming in over here as well. Okay, I have everything to start making some labs and some assembly plants. Okay. We'll just get one going. Uh, like right around here, I think. Yeah. Okay, so let's bring the glass over. Uh, nope. I'm gonna bring it in. Yeah, I'll leave it right there. I'll figure it out where I want to pull it in all the way after. And perfect. Okay. There's that. Oh, there's that. Oh, 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 oh. Okay. Wait. I'm gonna go like this. And then bring it down. Yeah. Something like that. And then the iron can come in over here. And then what else do I need? I need... Science lab. I need the chips. So for that, I can just split off. Do I have any splitters in my? No, no splitters. So you know what I'm gonna do? I'm just gonna snake it in and then snake it back out. There we go. Simple solution for not having a splitter.
And then this can come in. And this can come in. This can come in. And we can put down some storage for it after we put down a foundation. There we go. With our storage down here. Hook that up. Four. Yeah, I think that's good. Uh, now let's hook these guys up. And some power. And we're off. Actually. In case we want to uh, utilize that iron. There we go. Some more spaghetti. And there we go. Alright, let's go put down... Let's see what happens. like we might be able to make another one we can probably put it like this Now we're pumping out a good amount of uh, science. Let's pull it out of here. And line it up with this. There we go. Thank you. 
up further down the line like that leave us our room in case we want to make some more and add some power and some sorters there we go This should be a good pace for everything. I got yellow. Six yellow going now. No problem filling these up. There we go. Our science is a rocket now, a little faster. I wonder if it'll be able to go a little bit quicker or not. Well, we'll see. But. I might be picking up frequency now. It's cool watching those sails fly off the planet. might fill up eventually and start feeding into this I'd like to build a uh, off-world research facility eventually and then just uh, use my logistics to move all the uh, jello to that off-world facility I think that would be pretty cool okay So, working on our gas giant. Oh, that's, uh, no wonder. 1200. It's gonna take a while. But at least we ramped up our, uh, our science production. So, that will help get it done quick. What I'm gonna do now, I think, is look at Vendor 4 and figure out the best way to power stuff on it. So. Has bad solar energy, bad wind energy. Oh, but it has fire ice. So we can use that to make graphene and graphene and hydrogen. <clears throat> hydrogen could be used to power some burners, I think, right? Uh, uh, what's the rotation? Oh. 
Rotation period 513 seconds. What's like mine? This is ours. Or a rotation period 500 So similar, similar to. So the days are similar. Percent construction area, which is awesome. We'll probably lay down a bunch of foundation there. Yeah, I could make some foundation here. It has a lot of silicone, but not much else. Except the fire ice. The fire ice would be great. I'm just wondering how to best utilize this planet. I think the tricky thing uh, is the power. But I do have... I have these... Hold on. Uh, or maybe I saw it in the, uh, the tech... The tech tree. Energy exchanger. This is a ray receiver. Ray receiver from the dice swarm. Okay, so what is this? Energy exchanger. The power conversion facility can only store the surplus electric energy in the power grid into an empty accumulator to make full to make a fuel accumulator. It can also release the electric energy stored in. The okay, so this is for accumulators. Yes. Is there uh, technology to transfer power? What is this? Vertical launch side. Oh, interesting. Hey. 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 Calm down. Um, satellite power disappearance system. Come here. Calm down. Using the powerful magnetic field uh, excited by the super magnetic ring, there is no longer power transmission distance. There's a long, longer power transmission and large. Oh, this is just like a, a satellite power grid instead of using uh, power. Uh, Tesla Towers, I guess. That sounds pretty cool. A gas giant. Interstellar power transmission. Okay. Input power, 45. Hey! Gotta figure out how to use this properly. Okay. We have a good amount of this going. I should have a good amount of... Yeah, let's grab a bunch of these guys. Engines. This needs engines. Did I use up all my engines here? I did, I did, I did. 
Uh, let me go see if I have some more. Keep going the wrong way. My engines are... Right there. I need to put those over here. There we go. I have a, I have one interstellar logistics station and four planetary logistics. So I have a decent amount. So I'm gonna head off to Venator One, I think, and do some stuff over there. I got my uh, yellow science rocking pretty hard over here now. Going at full tilt. I should have my hydrogen over here. Pick some up. There we go. Oh, I have a little bit already. Oh, I have plenty already. Nice. Uh... Wrong buttons. I'm going to drop all these in here. Uh, leave behind this stuff. This other stuff I can use up there. Hey, calm down. What I should start doing down on this planet is start expanding the oil production and start uh, working on the ratios and things like that. Uh, but for now, I want to start bringing over some of these engines, uh, super magnetic rings, over to Venator. Let's charge up a bit. There's the uh, direction we want to go in. I think I have everything I need. Oh, Venator's on the far side. I'm gonna have to slingshot past the sun. Let's pick up some speed. Uh, burn some hydrogen. I love flying by the Dyson Swarm. Looks so cool. Just make sure we don't fly into the sun. Would you relax? Would you relax? There 
There we go. Bango, bango. So what I could do is I could start um, mining a shit ton of iron and copper on this planet since it has like 20 million and I could start shipping it over to that ashen planet and that could start supplying uh, production on that one. It's got 100% buildable area and it looks like a pretty big planet so it'd be a pretty good place to start building uh, a new main like uh, production area. So I think that's what I'm going to do. I'm going to start um, making accumulators. I want to make accumulators here. And in order to do that, I need these guys. And uh, we set local demand. And we need to set some vessels in here. Remote demand, that's what I need to set. And let's throw these vessels into here. Okay. And then let's throw uh, these guys into here. Awesome. And then from here, I can start uh, start producing those accumulators. I need iron. I need those silicone crystal things. Okay. I don't know what that other thing is. Two different kind of recipes. I was trying to figure out what that other... Uh, that other recipe was. What takes four seconds to make it with that one. That's such a cool sunrise. That's like a screenshot right there. Oh man, that looks so dope. So cool, so cool. Okay, so we have that coming in. And... Let's pick a spot. Over here. Has this filled up? Yeah. So now that that's all filled up, I'm just gonna let this overflow. These are... Oh, those are chips. Then this is what I need. I need these. I'm just gonna like bring it up like this. And then I need to smelt that into this. All right. And that's actually Smelt into that. I need a couple of those. And what else do I need? K 
Okay, and I need... What do I need? I need iron plates. Which I should have. Okay. We have enough room. Hmm. Oh, I do have enough room. Go like this. Bring it up like that. There we go. Bring it over and bring it down. What I'm going to do bring it up and over like so. Bring it up and over like so. Collide with other objects. What's it colliding with? There we go. Bring it up and over. And bring that down. There we go. Perfect. So we got that iron coming. This needs some power. And we wanna bring that in. And in case we wanna add more smelters, let's bring this up and over. That up and over, and then we'll set down an assembler. Set an assembler down. Put this assembler down here. Let's hook that up. That up. I lack item. I lack sorters. Okay, I'll just use one of these guys then. Set this to accumulators. There we go. Nice. What do we need to build that? Orbit collector. Okay. Pretty much have everything. Those accumulators? Full of 20 full accumulators. Interesting. Interesting. Okay, so... Uh, these full accumulators I have to make in an energy exchanger. All right, interesting, interesting. Well, for now, we're going to start some basic accumulators. Good. 
build these bad boys up. And we're gonna request... What are we requesting? These guys. Demand. Did I not set local supply on the... Uh... Set this up first. Bring it up like that. And like so. Drop some storage. Accumulator in there. Okay. Uh, let's go. Back over here. Uh, over here. That's where our supply is. Oh, yeah. A local supply. There we go. Game runs pretty good with even all of these, uh, all of these different, uh, logistics drones flying around. Alright. It's coming in. Just start popping out here. Weird. Okay, there we go. And we're off to the races. What I should do is replace this. With one of these faster ones. Yeah, now it's ripping. There we go. Accumulators are being created. So what I could do is I could supply So this is going to be creating accumulators I need to create those energy matrixes I could create like massive steel and and other uh, facilities here, mining facilities, and supply my uh, my local star system here on the Ashen planet. I think that's a good call. I think that's the plan because there's not much room to build on this one. It's pretty small. It'll fill up pretty quickly. So I think I'm going to focus on mining and refining on here, and then supplying my Ashen planet, which will not be mining and refining it will be well it'll be doing a bit of that but it will be uh mostly creating stuff so i think this is a good spot to end the stream i hope you enjoyed it uh please like and subscribe and i will see you in the uh next session take care have a great day